Hello everyone, it's Bubon, it's Zombie. Welcome back to Weird Park Scary Tales. I'm sorry about the last episode uh, that didn't have my commentary. Now I am definitely sure that the mic is on and working. So if there's no commentary on this episode either, I might have something going on with my equipment. But, um, so... Hopefully in the last episode I was able to give you guys the highlights of what happened. So our next step is going here and there is, we have the switch, there we go, let's start off with the realistic, oh, looks like merry-go-round goes underground, that looks like a key on top, is that a key? Click on the tabs to release the clamps holding the clock oops, holding the clock key in place. Okay, so it is a key. You must click on the tabs in a certain order to release all of the clamps. If you click on the wrong tab, all of the clamps will return to their original position. Okay, this will take some time. There we go. Okay, didn't take as long as I thought, but this is the clock key! So, don't think there's anything else around here, so let's go up to this castle. Okay, I see how it relates to Cinderella, not just the glass shoe that's in here, but also the pumpkin, and there are some wheels. Okay. Uh oh. According to the fairy tale, the car turned into a pumpkin at midnight. What will happen if I turn the clock back one hour? Can we use the clock key here or no? Okay. So, looks like we have to perform a little magic of our own by changing the time. Broom and hammer. Let's see, we can't go over there. Let's go upstairs. Here's the broom. There we go. That looks like something of where a key goes. Okay. Let's see if this works. Yes. Okay. Okay, so now it's a carriage, go out in front, oh, oh is that the little girl? This all reminds me of the Cinderella in the book of fairy tales I found in the flooded library. She's even missing a shoe. Okay, so we gotta get a shoe for her. Does it look like the Cinderella? It does! Okay, so our Cinderella is a brunette, not a blonde, as in the Disney version. Let's see. I don't think there's anything else we can do up here. So. Oh! Okay! Board! So, can we use this to cross? Yes, we can. That's gonna be some interesting steps we have to take. So we have a glass slipper, we also have that. But, I'm gonna give the slipper back to Cinderella. Oh, hello! Thank you. Now let's set the other kids free. Before Uncle Louise comes back. Ta-da! Oh, Why God. are you applauding? Who's there? Diana, did you invite a guest? <laughs> That's great! As I've grown bored. <laughs> <laughs> Who would you like to play hide and seek? There are several visitors in the park in addition to Diana. If you find them, I'll let everyone go. 
Mr. Dudley will keep a close eye on you and make sure you don't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I almost forgot. My name is Lewis. Lewis Gosh. Or rather, that was my name. As I no longer actually exist. <laughs> Isn't that great? Can you believe I invented all of this? Oh, this will be fun, don't you think? <laughs> okay, so, two things. One, did not expect that. Two, um, uh, Diana, the little girl, was saying Luis, and his name, he pronounced his name as Louis. Gauche, so I'm gonna call him Lewis. Lewis Gauche. Uh, and yeah, we got a new journal entry. Okay, I had a surprise encounter with Lewis the Clown. He has a creepy smile and an evil laugh, so I should be careful around him. On the other hand, he did invite me to play a game, and if I play according to his rules, he'll free he'll free the children as he he he'll free the children he kidnapped. Okay, so I have a new world to go to. Okay. According to the book of fairy tales, that's Peter Pan tied to the mass. I should be able to find other characters from that story here as well. Okay, so the next story, we just finished Cinderella. Now we're on Peter Pan. Ah. There he is. I didn't notice him at first. Okay. I should set that doll free. Okay. Join the handle and the lock to open the hatch. The lock is under one of the tiles. To join the handle and the lock, shuffle the free tiles along the empty spaces. Okay. Oh, there's the hatch. Okay. Just wondering where it was. Okay. There we go. Let's go around here. Ah, oh, there's a crowbar. This mechanism gonna need a lever. Anything else around? Door. <laughs> the door is locked! What a shock! Okay. Did an object seem? Letters and numbers, those are pro probably the position coordinates for the cannon. Okay, we have a cannonball and we have a torch, we need fuel for it. Ah. Load the cannonball. Okay. Need gunpowder. Let's go here. There it is. So tiny. Okay, we have a rope ladder. And... Oh, got some oars. go. Lowering the boat. Okay. 
crowbar back. There goes a seagull. Let's go way to board a boat. Nope. Oh, need some oars. Okay. Off to the island! Oh, Captain? It looks dangerous, I'm gonna leave it alone. Okay. Okay, so we know where to get fired, and there's roasted marshmallows! in the cage Captain Hook is protecting. It's like a fairy. Okay. <laughs> There's a croc. Crocodile's probably guarding that barrel, so stepping into that pond to retrieve the barrel could be dangerous. Agreed. Okay. We got a shovel. Circle with numbers, don't know what to do with them. Okay. I have a little mound here. Ah, oh, it's treasure! Or... Yeah! Stuff! We have a key. A map. Map fragment! Okay. okay so we're back we're on the ship. Just that quickly. Let's see. Let's see what this key leads. Into the captain's quarters! Hmm. Ah! Pike organ. Oh. Um. Ah, okay. <laughs> it's getting really fast, really quickly. I use the one as fuel, which is in far way to open the bottle. Okay, we have rope. Give okay, us a crowbar. <laughs> Hammer? Nope. Don't want to smash it. Okay, so we need a corkscrew for that bottle. Okay, we have that fragment. The new added to our journal. Okay. I found the missing piece of the map in the chest buried on the shore. Now I know the position coordinates of the dam. Okay. F3. Hello. Now I have a grappling hook. Big fish on the wall. Did an object scene. What is Oh, I was just there. <laughs> F 
three. But we need gunpowder. Okay. Okay, and we have a corkscrew. Okay. Still need gunpowder for that cannon. We have rum. Where is that? Is it down here? Yeah. Rum can be fuel. That's where all the rum went. Okay. So now we have a torch. Let's go light that torch. Oh wait. <laughs> Episode's running long. Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you later. Bye.